COVID-19 variant. How dangerous is Omicron? The World Health Organization has given the variant the name Omicron, following the pattern of Greek code names such as Alpha and Delta. On November 24, 2021, the B11529 variant was initially reported to WHO by South Africa. In South Africa, the epidemiological situation has been marked by three different peaks in reported cases, the most recent of which was represented by the Delta strain. Infections have risen sharply in recent weeks, matching with the discovery of the B11529 strain. The issue is that the virus has evolved significantly from the original, which was discovered in Wuhan, China. As a result, vaccinations developed using the original strain may be less effective. Some of the mutations have previously been identified in other variants, providing some insight into their likely role in this one. Some of them make it more difficult for antibodies to recognize the virus, which could make vaccines less effective while others are altogether new. They give us concern that this virus might have greater risk of transmission, enhanced ability to move from person to person, but might also be able to get beyond sections of the immune system. It was the best at avoiding the immune system. The beta variety was at the top of people's minds at the start of the year. But in the end, the planet was taken by the faster spreading Delta. Beta was all immune escape and nothing else, said Professor Ravi Gupta of the University of Cambridge. Delta had infectivity and modest immune escape. This potentially has both to high degrees. It also doesn't say how well the variation will spread in countries with far greater vaccination rates than South Africa's 24% completely vaccinated population, despite the fact that many people in the country have taken COVID. So, for the time being, we're locked into a variant that, despite big gaps in our understanding, raises serious worries, needs to be regularly checked, and raises serious considerations about what to do and when. The epidemic taught us that you can't always wait until you have all the answers. So, this is today's video about the new virus. If you want more interesting videos like this, then please like, share, comment, and subscribe to our channel. Till then, goodbye!